guys welcome back to my channel it's lauren and welcome to a weekend in my life this weekend is super special to me because one of my friends is getting married this weekend my friend allison's sister rachel is getting married and i got invited to the wedding i also get to film a little bit for it allison is putting together a really sweet video for her sister and obviously since allison is in the ceremony she can't film anything so i'm going to be filming some things for her but before i get going in this video i want to thank the sponsor this video is sponsored by cricut i actually made rachel something really cute to use at her ceremony for her cards that she receives. I think it's going to be really, really cute. I have worked with Cricut before and it was during Vlogmas and you guys had such a positive reaction to it. I'm so happy to be partnering up with them again for the spring. So I have the Cricut Maker and honestly, it's perfect for me and the kind of projects and everything that I use. Something that I was really concerned about whenever I got my Cricut was how to use it and how does it work? It was very confusing to me, but it was so easy to follow the step-by-step -step instructions that Cricut had online. They also have this thing that's called the Cricut Design Space, which is super easy. If you need some ideas, I always go on there. That is actually where I found my project idea for Rachel's cards. I also love doing projects with different materials. And so that is another reason why I chose the Cricut Maker is because the Cricut Maker can cut so many different materials, which is really, really amazing. A lot of people think that they can only cut like vinyl or like heat press vinyl. At least that's what I thought. But actually they can cut so, so much. They can cut delicate things like paper or fabric. It can also cut very tough stuff like leather, which is really, really impressive. I also love how easy my Cricut is to use and I'm just going to be going through my project that I used for Rachel's cards. So obviously, like I said, I went on the Cricut design space and I actually looked up wedding and it came up with so many cute ideas. This one was the rustic wedding card sign. Um, so I just used my Cricut premium vinyl and then right when you go onto your Cricut, it asks you what material you are cutting so it knows exactly like I guess how hard to press down on it to cut it through. Every product that I've done with Cricut has been so easy and so quick to do. Once my vinyl gets done cutting, I then peel the access off of it and then I weed it. So basically that just means like getting the little pieces out so you can read the letters that I cut. Then it was time to put it on the transfer tape, then transfer it onto my wood board. Then I peeled off that transfer tape and that vinyl stuck beautiful to that board. It turned out to be a beautiful, beautiful project and I know Rachel is going to love it. Thank you Cricut for sponsoring this video. I had such an amazing time creating this fun project for Rachel. If you want to get your hands on your own Cricut Maker. I will be leaving everything that you need to know down in the description box below. So I am now going to be heading home and getting ready for the wedding. I'm getting super duper excited and I also cannot wait to show you a little snippet of her wedding. I have gone to so many different weddings this wedding season but I haven't been able to video record just because of like privacy with the bride and groom but this one I actually have the privilege to show you a little bit and bring you really along for the wedding so I cannot wait to bring that along. I love you guys. I'll be seeing you a little bit later in the weekend. Hey guys! <laughs> Howdy. Welcome back to my channel. It's Lauren. So actually, I was going to vlog yesterday because we had this really cute wedding and I was going to do a get ready with me, but my camera battery was not liking that idea and I actually forgot to pack a camera battery and a charger for it. And she had to record like videos of the wedding for the bride, so. Yeah. She couldn't really waste the battery on the vlog because, you know, who wants to have that conversation with a bride? <laughs> um, exactly. Couldn't couldn't film your wedding because I had a vlog. <laughs> I did get some really cute clips though. So I'm going to be putting like her like little montage here.
now we are having a date night, which I still have like half a camera battery life left, but I don't think it's going to last that long. But I have this other big camera that we're going to be using just in case, but I don't have any hope in it being good. But we're gonna try anyways. But of course, we're in line at Starbucks and we're gonna get a drink. Yeah. And then we're going to be going to dinner in Birmingham. Going to P.F. Chang's. Super excited. It's going to be Super so good. Excited. Look, the battery's dying. Unbelievable. What are we going to do? I don't know how this is going to work. Look at how massive this is. Maybe you can swap the lens. I don't think. I don't I don't think so either. Think but like, it's a possibility. It's, I'm we just, can I'm explore. Just out here, you you got to film that. You look like a cow. Like, Grazing on some grass. Grazing on some grass. <laughs> yeah. Hello. Hello. We got our Starbies and it looks and tastes delicious. It does. Will and I changed position, so he's over there driving and I'm in the passenger seat. Okay, why is this so zoomed in? I just have to be like. Well, I didn't expect to not have my battery or charger. Yeah. Everything is in test place. So now we're vlogging with this. I don't know what's going on. Hello? We made it to dinner to P.F. Chang's and we're so excited. <laughs> So we're at dinner on the iPhone. We love the quality of the iPhone video. It's just so <laughs> Wait, you mean it's so good? It's so beautiful. Uh -huh. It is. Flash. We got a good appetizer. A good sampler of everything. We got some wontons, edamame. What are those things called? Dumplings. Dump dumplings? Well, I don't know. Dumplings wontons? Dumplings wontons. Okay, I definitely did not know that. And then the spring rolls. We're definitely about to take it on the Yeah, we kind of uh, outdid ourselves well, with the food. It's better to get more than the eight than less than the eight. Because you'd rather leave absolutely full and have extras rather than eat everything and still want more. That is so true. So, I mean, we're set with all of this yummy, yummy food. I am so pumped for it. Am I making Will go to Trader Joe's with me? Absolutely. Yeah. Absolutely. I mean, have you ever seen a more pretty sight? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Actually, a lot. I haven't. So, hello friends. It has been a little while since you last saw me. And that is because your girl was dumb and forgot her camera battery and it had been sitting right there the whole entire time. I am now currently back in Tuscaloosa because that is where I left my camera battery, obviously. And I couldn't film anything until then because my battery was completely dead. I really wanted to bring you along for more of the weekend, but unfortunately I didn't get to because like I said, but I learned my lesson. I now know to always check my camera bag and make sure I have my camera battery and the charger I have an extra battery and everything like this should not have happened and I'm so so sorry that it did but I really hope that you enjoyed the wedding clip that I got to put in here and then like our sort of kind of date night through my iPhone <laughs> that was an event in itself but I wanted to thank you so much for coming along for a weekend in my life if you enjoyed it be sure to give it a big thumbs up and if you want to join the family and click that subscribe button also I love you guys so much and I'll be seeing you in my next video bye